So, medyo malilim yung background ko. So, today I'm just going to update you about MEDVA for those uh, aspiring medical virtual assistant. So, there's a new update. Okay, so these informations are coming from the applicants of MEDVA for those who already pass the pre-assessment final interview. Okay? <clears throat> Kaya din sa mga nagme-message sa akin about this uh, previous or my uh, ano yan? Yung dati kong video last this year ba yun? Last year. Ayan. So, so far yun pa rin siya. Okay, ganun pa rin yung process and uh, ayan, may, meron lang akong bago ni dadagdag and usually Yung mga nagme-message sa akin, so congratulations at least. Makikita niyo naman yung mga comments nila na they pass the examination. Most of them pass the examination because of the advice that I gave them. I usually talk to them directly sa Facebook, like what advice that I could give them during the interview and also the examination. Okay? So some, for some, if they have time, we usually have some practice interview. Pero during the sa interview nila, it's gonna be easy for them. Hindi na sila pinakabahan. And then, ayun. Ano ba yung mga changes ni Medva today? So again, dun sa examination. So the same pa rin dun sa una kong video. So, I already have the list. And, yun, natutuwa lang ako dun sa isang applicant because he made a reviewer about dun sa mga binigay kong list. And I am willing to give you all the, I'm giving you, I am willing to give you that reviewer. But, yes, siguro naman papayag siya. And he really made an effort to research and create an, a reviewer pala for the examination. And he's really dedicated to uh, pass the examination because he really wanted to become a virtual, a medical virtual assistant. Oh, yeah. In addition pala, dun sa examination, oh yeah, parang nagdidepende yung examination sa kung anong uh, i-applyan ninyo. For medical biller, yun, sa mga may experience, medyo, hindi naman, may, medyo mahirap. Okay, kasi meron yatang numbers. Yung, yung, yung mga situations. I'm sure if you have uh, call center experience, like sa medical billing, it's gonna be easy for you Kasi most of those na nag-message nag sa akin sa messenger sa Facebook, ayun, tinatanong ko sila like, oh, ano, masaya ba? Or madali ba? For them, it's easy because they have hmm, call center experience, especially just sa mga medical biller. Sa mga health insurance, yan, advantage na yan. So, ayun. Next, meron then for the medical virtual assistant without experience. Sabi nung isa walang exam, I don't know kung totoo, kung wala ba silang examination. So, iba na process ngayon. So, parang magkakaroon muna sila ng training, like mm, language training. Parang ganun. Tapos, yun. Basta yung sa exam, message ni kung paano mag, mag, ano yan? Kung paano mag-answer ng, ng exam. Tapos, I'm going to give you the reviewer that one of the applicants actually made. And then again, I am not, hindi ako taga medfa. So, and I'm just giving you some help on how to pass the examination and also the interview. Okay, for some, sabi ko nga, nagpa-practice kami. 
it is manu it is my way of helping other people for them to have an idea on how to pass the examination and the interview. Ayan. And I'm just so happy really for those who already passed and perhaps working as a uh, medical virtual assistant for MEDFA. Okay, ayun, for those who are interested or for those who want to learn more, just message me and follow me on Facebook. Mm, yung pangalan ko is Apo Labong. And then, just comment down below kung sino yung interested. Para at least, ayun, ano pa ba? Ah, okay, wait. I have to check. <clears throat> Saan ba yun? Ah, ito. Ito ha. Ano lang. Based ito sa mga naging nag-message sa akin. Wait. Ito. Sabi ng isa, I'm going to read one of the applicant's um, message. Sabi niya, mahigpit yung interviewer. Tinanong niya kung ano may yung mga ginagawa ko nung hinandle ko ng claim as in lahat ng job description na sinabi ko. So, pinaisa-isa niya. Tapos, bakit ako umalis sa job? Yun daw yung bakit siya umalis sa previous job niya. Okay, yun nga sabi ko sa inyo. Walk, through, uh, walk me through your resume. Ibig sabihin, dapat alam mo lahat ng nilalaman ng resume. Kasi, tatanangin nila kung totoo ba lahat mga nakasulat sa resume. So, yun yung lagi ko sinasabi na paganda nyo. <clears throat> so, kung alam mo yung kung anong year ka nag-start, kung anong year ka nag-stop, Yung, yung year na nag-stop ka, tatanungin nila, like, ano yung ginawa mo nung nag-stop ka? So, dapat you have to give them credible answers or good reasons why you stopped working. Okay? And then, what else? Walk me through your resume. Ayun. Of course, alam nyo yung mga positions na inarabaho nyo. So, it means that you have to know your 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 tasks and your responsibilities as, like, for instance, as a teacher or as a nurse. So, ano ba yung responsibilities niya? Kailangan alam niyo yun. And then, meron pa. Ayun, sabi niya, ang tagal po ng interview namin. Halos 30 minutes. Ayun, so, ano pa yun? Ah, yun. Tina-define niya eh. What is prior authorities? Prior authorization. So, this is a review na ibibigay ko sa inyo. Okay, coming from the other applicants na gumawa. So, free na yan. At least, pag ni-review niyo yun, mas easy niyo na siyang answering even the examination. Ang cute nga nung gumawa. Ano kasi yung pangalan niya? Ayan, itatago natin siya sa pangalang Paul. Okay, sa so, ang kulit-kulit niya. Ang, ang, ang cute-cute niya. Tapos ano pa ba? Ayan, mostly working experience. Kung meron kayong working experiences sa uh, BPO, uh, kung meron kayong healthcare experience, yan. Okay, you just really need to be honest with your answers. What else? Ah, yan. Basta, yan lang. Wait. Sino pa ba? Ah, okay, wait lang. I have to read another message coming from the, from the applicant who already passed. Nasa na siya. Her name is... Of course, hindi ko sasabihin kung sino. Ayan. Lagi yung sinasabi sa akin ng mga nagme-message sa akin. Likewise po, lakas maka-good vibes ng post niyo po. Ayan. Parang ayan. Ito. Ayan. 
Kaya pa ba yan? Ay, hindi. Wait. Para minsan nila lang yung ito, another experience. Ah, this one. So, this one, ang, ang, ang kulit-kulit din niya. Yan, I'm, she's really, she's really smart and witty. Parang si Paul. Ito yung, ito, basahin ko, ha? I ask her, I ask her about, uh, sabi ko, I ask her, ano yung mga questions? <laughs> Nang sama ako. Yan, parang binibiyo ko kayo ng late. Hindi naman DK. So, I mean, at least an idea because, again, different uh, interviewers, different questions din naman. But at least you have an idea. At is sabi niya, what's lang po ako na interview? Actually, isa lang po question sa akin. Tapos, uh, parang, do you have, do you have US healthcare experience? Can you tell me what do you like? Oh, what do you do like your typical day today task? Then I Sinabi ko na lahat. Then, sa dulo sabi ko po, I'm looking for a new opportunity for me to grow as well and to learn something new to myself because learning is never ending process. Choo -choo. Uh, diba? Then I ang sabi sa akin, congratulations, I passed the interview. In case the orientation will be on Monday. Uh, diba? Ayan. Ano pa? Ayun lang. Ayun lang yung na-question sa kanya kasi napakagaling naman niya. Ayan. Ayan lang. Uh, again, do not forget. You walk me through your resume. You have to know your resume. Kung ano yung nilalaman. This seems examination. Ayan. Meron bagong... Kailangan ni review. So again, if you want to have an idea on what to review, meron kaming reviewer. This again, this is for free. We are just helping you guys on how to pass medva and how to pass the interview. Again, kung sino yung may gusto magpa-practice, I'm just here for you. Okay? So yan, gusto ko lang din kasing tumutulong ng ibang tao. Especially yung and then, I know the reason why you are, you are applying for this position is for us to have a better life, diba? So, yun, yun lang, um, you, you update sa med pa. Okay, so, good luck sa inyo lahat. Then, uh, message me, follow me on Facebook, ako, Lalo. Ayan na, Paul Labong. Tapos, yan nandiyan naman sa link ko. I, ilalagay ka na lang. And then, <clears throat> comment lang kayo dyan. Then, ano pa ba? Comment lang kayo kung may questions kayo. And then, you can message me on Facebook. Follow me on Facebook. Okay? So, again, good luck and God bless you everyone. Bye-bye.